So what's up guys, we have another French MRE for you guys. Well actually, another Not MRE. Not French MRE, but a French MRE. This one actually has the contents on the box, like in English, so we probably just read it out first before we crack her open. So we got a ready, ready, cook, ready cooked dishes, it's chili con carne. Tuna fish salad. It's gotta you gotta eat that cold, but we're not too much fans of fish. A starter, which is 100% duck plate. Soup, milky dessert, salted and sweet biscuits, coffee, tea, chocolate, nougat, fruit jelly, energy bar, muesli. Nougat. Yeah, nougat, nougat. Uh, muesli, isotonic power drink, chocolate bar, jam, tissues, reheating kit, and purifying tablet. So that's our French MRE. We're just gonna crack it open. I don't know if you Oh, fucking weird. So the pack is really easy to open. We got a nice neat box. Have fun there. Oh, well done. Alright, so on the top, we have some delicious. It's very thing. neatly packed. I don't know if you guys can see that. Normally they're not that neat. It is so neatly packed. And it's quite heavy. You so, nice. we've got muesli. I'm assuming some sort of porridge muesli. That's porridge. I said this is just porridge. Porridge. We'll put it out on the table and we'll go for it for you. So this is the hot chocolate and coffee. And I think the tea would be in the middle. Oh yeah. Apricot puree. That's a well. That's well, a um, that's <laughs> that is a easy. nice isotonic drink. Some dishes. Serviettes. Go on. That's your tuna salad right there. Uh, yeah. 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 Nice little oh, tuna. Yeah. That's. It says caramel. Is that caramel? <laughs> Come on. Yeah, it's tuna. It's tuna. It's tuna. I think it's tuna anyway. I have no idea what the fuck that is. <laughs> That'd be your milky dessert. So that's cream rice. This is awesome. Coffee energy bar. Is that? That is a coffee energy bar. That'd be the chocolate, I guess. Yeah, that's the fruit one. The fruit bar. That is the chocolate. Ah, oh, yeah. 1848 dark chocolate. They all, all these MRE kits come with dark chocolate because I'm guessing it lasts longer. Go on, tell me what that is. That's a fruit bar. <laughs> <laughs> There's a nougat. Nougat. It's nougat. It's nougat bar. So That's these are uh, army campaign biscuits. Oh, there's a fire kit. And we got our little fire kit that I'm gonna light on the table. <laughs> Again. <laughs> Again. Mum's gonna kill you. And then we got our chili con carne. And our thorn is salad. Which is tuna salad. So that is the tuna salad. Yeah, that's a tuna salad. I don't know what's in that one. And what was on the box that didn't make a list? Alrighty, so let's just clear the table and we'll start with. Do you want to start with the nibbly shit? Or do you want to just go straight? We'll, we'll set up the <sighs> con carne to heat up and then we'll try nibbly shit and then eat the con carne. Yeah, fire starter this. I'll start this fire starter up. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's. Yeah. Oh, oh Jesus. That's all baggy. Oh, you get a little we French matches. We got a little fork. With the Eiffel Tower. There's your purifying tablet. There's your purifying tablet. Let's see some. Um, grab the cover. What the hot water's on. So you don't put it on the table, because I don't want to oh, hear Oh, this one's so much well designed. <clears throat> I don't want to hear mum shit. When she's like, you are cooking on my table! We're what definitely this? gonna start a fire. <clears throat> I don't know. The cross member. Not for sale. Oh, it's a little fucking. Let's pick it up. Oh, beast! Other side, you would fall off. No, from underneath. Oh, it's to pick the can up as well. Grab the can as well. Alright, cool. Right, let's get this little fire. You got a little foggy. Match, please. 
Jordan, fucking grab the big one with the hot water on it. And that smells through the tin. Oh yeah, that's yeah. That's the feel. It's fucking fair. <laughs> First strike. I'm going go from the side. This one lights so much easier. Just the rest of the match. Alright, do we have to crack these? No. For the next play? Yet. Alright, so what we're doing while that is heating up, right here, we're yeah, going. Chili con carne cooking. Oh, chili con carne is delicious. What do you want to start with? Uh, we'll Ooh. start with. I'll mix a beverage. So we're gonna make the ice tonic drink while you open. Uh, I should probably yeah. open some muesli. You're gonna need a bowl for it, I think. Definitely. Oh no, it says the slowly pour amount of water, cold or warm, 125 ml, stir and at some time. And let's see. So you're gonna prep this muesli, get everything at the bottom. It's an add milk powder and stuff in it. Breakfast course. Well, this one's brown. Good. There's our muesli powder. We got our little fire cooking. Get the isotonic drink ready. Just gonna pour some water in this and get this prepped. What's that chocolate in it? That's not bad. It's got chocolate little chunks in it. Try that. I don't know how to describe it. An orange citrus. It's not very strong though. We're definitely on fire for this food. I can smell it. It smells chocolatey. So this um this muesli here has got chocolate in it. Like, it had chocolate chip chunks in there. I may have put a little bit too much water, but yeah, we're gonna let it sit and let it cook. That's gonna pop. Okay. <laughs> That's good. Can you blow it out, Mother Ding? Let's crack it up. So we blew out the, the chili con carne because it would look like it was about to explode. Yeah, we didn't, we didn't crack the can or anything, so it's it's well inflated. It's still going at the moment. Like, it's pretty puffy. It's still puffing it's, up. It's puffing up. And we got our muesli. All right, let's eat some bars. I'm, yeah, I'm let's quite eat some, hungry, so. Let's have some bars. Um, we'll leave the chocolate till after. Which one do you want? Well, we'll start with the, the fruit one. We'll taste test the um the fruit one first, and then we'll try the one. Oh, this looks good. This is like a sugar coated. I think it's I think it's apple or pear. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. it's sugar coated. I like you take a little bite just in case it tastes like shit. Yeah, nah, that's really good. That is really good. Hmm. It's so sweet. No. One more. Looks too sweet for me. No. You got it. He's got it. Go away first. So leave that one for next. Alright. So we got the purple one. This is like a yogurt bar. Yeah, that's it. It looks good. The yogurt? Yeah, you got it in the back or something. It's alright. Nothing flash. You don't need to No ice in any of it. Down the hatch. Oh, actually, might be a bit too powdery for me. That mm. that one's really powdery. It's very dry. All right, we're gonna open our new get AUX fruits. It's still popping up. Yeah. Crazy. Oh, that ice on a drink tastes like nothing after you have the other thing. 
Oh, damn. This actually looks really good. Yeah, they close up for Just leave the thing before. There you go. Bits of sultana. Sultana, a little bit of fruit. Oh, that's really good. Yeah. You get, you get so good. It smells like plastic. Yeah, it does. It smells a lot like plastic. You gonna polish it? No. It's got the consistency of plastic. <laughs> like clay. Played out in a treat. Is this a porridge? Mm -hmm. Or is that's no, a soup? We need to skip out of that. Let's do that last. I don't feel like eating soup. Ah, uh, what's next? We gotta... Let's find out what's in the mystery can. Alright, we'll do a mystery can opening. It says Hemnaf de Paris, and I, I think it says Roulette's de Carnet. I have no I idea. Video. No idea what's in this. I think it might be a cheese. Could be a cheese. It doesn't feel like it's heavy. No, it's like a little meat. Salted meat. It smells like dog food. I'll get the fork out. I'll get some biscuits. I'll open up the biscuit. Apparently it's a mixture of sweet and savory ones, so... They're the plain. Just to let you know, that's the fish. That's tuna. Ah, oh, wrecked. We got like dark rye looking ones. Get these. So me and Melania aren't a fan of tuna. We do not eat fish. I just went balls deep in this. <laughs> and it's tuna. Hold up, get these. So you got like the, the savory ones, a couple of sweet ones. So they're savory. So you so. stand they're a biscuit. Plain, yeah. And you got a sweeter one. I'm guessing this is sweeter. And no, they're, they're the sweet one. They're the sweet one. That's chocolate. But the arrowroot ones there in the middle. All right, we're gonna crack a pack of these each. Just one of each. No, oh, I guess we'll have apricot on them. Yeah. Who the fuck wants to eat tuna? One? Yeah. Save these for later. Jordan, you took in all of the other ones and not the one we want. My bad. A bicky each. Just so they feel like a piece of wood. They sound yeah. like a bit of ply. Yeah, a little bit of wood. Get some wood. Oh, hard rock wood. It's chocolatey. It's actually pretty good. Yeah, this one's a chocolate biscuit. What's we'll taste this more than? Um, you eat cream rice with on the cut and you don't need to put the shit. Um, apricot spread. Right. Softness. So plain one. Plain one. The that salty. was fucked up. The salty. It's like the salted one. That's the salt one. Alright, and this one should be the neutral one here. Chocolate, salt, and hopefully neutral. Yeah, this is a normal biscuit. Yeah, that's the arrowroot normal. Now we gotta crack some jam open. I'm on it. Alright, which one do you want this jam on? Oh! The standard one. Got a little jam there. That's not bad. It's all about already. It's so chocolatey. Got so much chocolate in this means like. Oh wow. We absorbed it all. Calm down, you're next. Alright. So I'm gonna show you guys. Look at that shit. This is what we got going on here. This is the muesli and it it had chocolate chunks in there. So it just melted down into chocolate. Yeah, it says with chocolate. So we'll just give this a taste test. Probably gonna end up eating all this afterwards. Is it all? Yeah. <laughs> oh fuck, it feels hot. I feel like it could have add sugar to that. Because it doesn't taste sweet. It just tastes like muesli. Straight muesli. Mm. Well, that might be... Crack and sugar. I'm gonna mix it in. I think something to go with it. I reckon this jam would get good, isn't it? 
some jam in it. So add a bit of sweetness jam into that. Yeah, the jam, like the sweetness in it will cut straight through all that, like neutral. Already better. All right. Polish that off after. Oh. Do you want to move to the main event or do you want to try this coffee bar? We'll try the coffee bar. Need a bit of energy. That's our energy bar. Bare energy cafe. I'm guessing it's coffee. Cafe. It's a from lab. <sighs> it's definitely a coffee bar. Oh, it smells just like espresso. What's it there? I'm really not keen for this, which is bitter. Not too much a fan of it. It's grainy, very grainy. It's got seeds in it. It does have like a light taste of coffee, but it's very grainy because I'm guessing it's an energy bar, so. I'm gonna polish it off. Millen's like, just eat this, I don't wanna eat it. No, no, I like coffee. Alright, have some cream rice. You can cry over. But I'll polish this off. Wash it down. Mm. Well, it's off the bars when I go. Oh, Jordan, you're gonna fucking have to feel that. Look at that. The struggle is real trying to down that bar just now. Oh, not good. Grab us a spoon. Come on, Chief. Oh, it smells creamy as all fuck, like oh. custard. Oh. Ah. Alright. I'm not too much a fan of that coffee bar. It is killing me. It is legit killing me. This will make it better. All time favorite, cream rice. <laughs> Can't go wrong with the cream rice. Even if we heated that up, I reckon it'd still be like awesome. Yeah, it's got some dense milk in it. I love cream rice so much. That's creamy. All right, the main event. What you've all come waiting for. Chili con carne, is it hot? Yeah. Alright, I'll yep. peel it open. Peel I'll take the risk. Now this container is really hot. We left it on. It's not hot at all. I'll peel it though. This one actually opens without a knife. Oh, look at the look at the beans, Jordan. The smell is this wafting out of this can. Oh, it smells so good. You peel it off the can, don't you? It won't. Just gonna pull the tab off. Try go like angle. And smell the chili in this. This would be good with tacos. Maybe that's what the neutral um, crackers are for. Possibly. There we go. Give us some shot of that. So this is unmixed, so we haven't even mixed it yet. That's just what's on top. Oh, it's spicy. Do we mix it on? It smells really, really spicy. It it is spicy when I lick my finger. <laughs> So there's a couple of good, nice kidney beans in there. Grab a fork, do it, do it at the same time. Taste do wanna, test. Do you want to have it on the cracker? No. Alright. I'm smart enough to blow it. Bottoms up. Yeah. That's cool. Appreciate some tortillas in the kitchen. Yeah, this is definitely going good on tortillas. It literally is just burrito meat. Yeah, it's burrito meat. Chili con carne. Maybe tacos out. Some lettuce. Delicious. No, nah, I don't want them chip. I'm gonna have a crack it. Alright, you think that's about it? Here's flogging that cracker. <laughs> Alright, that thorn salad over there. I don't know if you heat this up. That's got fish in it. That is chunks of fish. Oh, so we got a can of tuna and we got fish. That's a tuna salad. Now I'm gonna eat this anyway because for the video, but oh yeah. Let's just say I'm not looking forward to it. Smell fishy. <laughs> it's not the greatest smell. No, <laughs> oh, yuck. There you go, guys. You got a tuna salad. I won't eat it. I refuse. Sorry, guys. I do not do seafood at all. Don't worry. I'll do it for you. You can see that the reactions. There's a nice big chunk of tuna on the box. Isn't it salmon? No, it's tuna. Just tuna? 
There you go, guys. Oh, wait, wait, I want, yeah. I want the GoPro on your face when you eat it. Well, it's, it's not bad. I don't, I, don't, I don't like tuna, but it's not bad. It tastes like food because it's tuna. I'm definitely not going to eat it all. I can tell you that. Did you just eat them around it and eat the vegetables or is it all through the whole lot? There's tuna fish oil all through the whole container. So if you don't like tuna, you're not eating this. Well, I don't like tuna, so I'm not eating it. But I tasted it for you guys. You're lucky I wouldn't, I wouldn't eat it at all. Well, French, you guys have a lot of fish in your diet. Well, it's a very sweet meal, the Samari. Like, there's a lot of sweet things in it, but then you've got your chili con carne. Um, there's a lot of fish, so you got good preservatives and stuff. Proteins. Yeah, proteins. What have we got left? Alright. Uh, Chocolate. I'm gonna top it all off up with that. Uh, do you want to try your soup, your porridge? Porridge. Underneath your heat thing? More. Yeah, I guess so. I'll have to have a bowl for it, I think. There you go. Just Mr. Garni in your soup cup. Flicked it on me. I don't know why you even taste that. Nah, fuck off. Not eating it. So this, you want to grab a GoPro? Grab a Z GoPro. Show us what the porridge looks like dry. Oh. Smells like poo. It doesn't smell that good. <laughs> what does it smell like? I don't know. It's, it's not porridge. It's soup. It smells like. I think it's a French onion soup. Like, that'll be enough for a like, bit more. It smells like chip board. It just makes it. It'll thicken up. Mm, it doesn't have the greatest smell. <laughs> Man, it's like a French onion soup by the looks of it, but you never know until you taste it. Put more water in it. It's too thick. Damn. Go treat it like you're making gravy. It looks like gravy. Exactly, it's too thick. It's supposed to be a soup. That, that's gonna be overpowering and you're strong. Just a little bit more hot water to make it spicy. It's like it's efficient. It does. Everything in this basket thing has fish in it. I think I just put too much water in it. No, no, it'll thicken up, don't worry. Okay, guys. End product of that powder. It's become a soup. A little bit more mixing and it should be beautiful. Beautiful. Um, beautiful. And I'm um, polishing off that chili con carne. Oh, that's a fish soup. <laughs> it's not very good. It just tastes straight fish. I should have let Milan go for that one, but I didn't. That is definitely just straight fish, and I'm not a fan. <laughs> You wanna try? Nope. Nope. I don't want to be sick. Alright, we're gonna um, skip over the soup. We're gonna finish soon. <laughs> 1848, 64% de car caro. A nice dark chocolate. There you go, guys. Nice dark chocolate here. 64 is not really that dark. Oh! It's very broken. It's crumbled as fuck. It's all over the floor. My mum is down again. Mum's gonna kill us. It's a creamy one, it's not even dark chocolate. It's dark chocolate, you can taste the dark chocolate. Yeah, but it's not very good. It's like, it's not strong. I think, it, I think it's melted a bit. I have melted it. It's coffee chocolate. Oh, for fuck's sake. It's, it's just that blown up. It's probably from our, from the Australian weather. Just getting in the mail and everything. The mail room must have been hot and then when it, we got it, it's cooled down. You can see in this piece here, it's separated. Mm -hmm. But not bad. It's really good chocolate though. Yeah. Besides the powder. Oh, I'm not even, no, that just falls out. That's more. You feel sick after that fish yeah. soup, eh? Yeah. <laughs> this is really good chocolate. It's coffee. Coffee chocolate. What can you get wrong? Okay. Alright. Why don't you want to make a hot chocolate? Well, thanks for checking this out, guys. Make sure you check both our channels out, not just his. <laughs> because his is getting a shit ton of views and mine's just getting none. I think I'll just post it on his channel, so obviously 
I'll put my links down below to my channel, but the video will be up on his. Uh, I think that's everything. So make sure you give, make sure you check out the channel, like, favorite, subscribe, all that other jazz. Share it with your friends. I've been finding that depending on which country we're doing, it's being shared in that community. So we hope to see some of your French viewers. And as always, peace. How good was the fish, George? I wanted to try it. Did you think it? Did you see it? I don't know if it was fish, but I'm pretty sure I could taste fish. Oh, it's hella thick. Yeah. <laughs> Just taste it. It's fish. <laughs> I told you. You fucking. It didn't, it didn't look like fish. I, when I smelt it, I knew it was fish straight away. I was like, that's definitely fish.